hello and welcome to the Daily Job Digest by the Travel with Glenn Browns. I wanted to tell you about this company that is looking for map teacher okay now for the month of march i said that i wanted to share with you guys at least one job a day uh, from a company that is hiring remotely and internationally which means that if you are living sorry in the caribbean in africa in asia or in europe you stand a chance to learn an online job so i'm sharing only jobs that are available to the international market so if you want to make sure that you stay tuned and you get notified every single time a new job is open make sure that you subscribe to my channel and share this with as many people as you know will be eligible. Now let's talk about this company. Study.com is a company that focuses on offering educational contents to people around the world and they also offer content across different specialties. Right now they are looking for somebody to help them in creating map content and as you can see here they are looking for people from different countries. So again like people in the Caribbean, in Africa, in Europe, in Asia, I am speaking to you, all right? They are looking for somebody at the entry level, which means that you don't need to be an expert for you to apply. No, what does a job entail? Um, Study.com is dedicated to making education accessible and valuable. Our math lesson writers develop rich quality lessons for students from middle school to college level. So you will be creating math lesson plans and lessons for people um, in middle school and at the college level. They are looking for instructors, course developers, and educational copywriters, or basically writers, to contribute to their library of engaging online lessons in math subjects, including basic arithmetic, algebra, geometry, trigonometry, calculus, and statistics. Now, if math is your thing, then this job should be your thing, okay? Now, what is going to happen? They're going to give you a lesson outline with optimized section headings and content prompts. You will create an engaging written lesson between 1,000 to 2,000 words. That is approximately four to five pages, okay? and you will create a descriptive title for the lesson. Each lesson will culminate in a brief summary to emphasize key concepts and prepare students for a short quiz. You will also write short targeted answers for two to six preselected FAQs related to your lesson. You can choose what you want to work on from a pool of lesson outlines covering a variety of math topics, which means that if algebra is, your, is not your thing and you prefer geometry, then you can choose to write a lesson in geometry, okay? But you will need to perform research search to support the information in your lesson. Now, what qualifications, what are the requirements for you to be in, to, to apply for this job? You need to have a bachelor degree. You need to have an expert knowledge of mathematical concept. Now, remember when we talk about expert knowledge, it doesn't necessarily mean that you need to have learned math at a, high, a very high degree. It means that you need to have a good mastery of math for the topics that you want to teach, okay? So don't be, don't start getting intimidated. Don't start to back down in your mind and be like, oh my God, I'm not an expert. No, it's not that. Um, you should also have strong writing skills. And if you have taught at a, at a high school or you know elementary school or, or university school or college level, then this, show, this job should be attainable for you, okay? Um, preferred qualifications, you have developed online academic course or lesson content. So if you've ever taught online or ever taught at all, you have one to three years teaching experience. Look at that in middle school, high school, and or college level and or an advanced degree. So if you're in Dominica, for example, and you have taught maths in the, at the Dominica State College, then you can apply for this job, okay? Um, you have experience with HTML, wiki code, latex, or imaging software. Again, those are preferred qualifications, which means that even if you don't have experience in those, then you can still apply. Now, what does the company offer? Reliable payment um, twice a month via PayPal. All work is paid per piece, and uh, per piece rates vary based on complexity and length of the content that you create. Independence, which means there is no assignment and a massive library of lessons for you to choose from. Flexibility, which means you can work from anywhere, and supportive staff. They also explain a little bit about their contract process and more about the company, which is study.com which is very dedicated to online education. Now, how do you apply for this job? So from the link that is included in the description box of this video, you're going to click and it's going to take you to this page, okay? Then you can apply, including your first name, last name, email address, phone number, your physical address, and then include your resume, either attach your resume or you can paste your resume. Now, one of the things that usually happens is that 
uh, when you're applying for online jobs, you're trying to apply with your current existing physical jobs resumes. When in reality, when it comes to online jobs, you need to optimize your resume for online jobs. So if you need assistance in writing your resume and actually making sure that your resume is at the level where it makes you competitive for any online job that you're applying for, I have a resource called the Remote Jobs Directory, which basically gives you cover letters and resume templates that are optimized for online jobs and make it very easy for you to learn an online job, okay? So you can find the link to the um, Remote Jobs Direct, um, sorry, to the Remote Work Starter Pack, sorry, which includes my cover letters and resume templates in the description box of this video. Um, in addition, you can um, include all the other information uh, pertaining to employment eligibility here, and then you click on submit application. I wish you good luck and let me know how it goes when you apply for this job. I can't wait for you to land your first remote job. Of course, as I mentioned before, if you don't see your skills category mentioned in one of these videos, make sure you comment um, below so that I know what your skills category is and we can find jobs related to your skills category. Until then, have a great day and see you in the next video. Bye.